red ma flag man is out there. They're just about to come out to start his orders. In fact, they are started of out of start his orders. There's John Weir's horse there who's going to take them on, Joshua. Joshua goes around. No, he doesn't. He's just been overtaken by Newsworthy, a very quick Newsworthy war horse is up there in second. So Newsworthy war horse, and then goes uh, Le Leslie Circum, Downton Abbey, Richard Cabet on Downton Abbey. And Downton Abbey in uh, the front runner all the time is going to be Newsworthy. Newsworthy, Downton Abbey, the pace is quite quick. War horse is tucked into three. Then we've got Blitzkrieg and fourth spot goes back to Joan Weir's Joshua. And then we go to Ali's May. Behind Ali's May, uh, we've got the all green there of Malou. And the rest of them are all bunched up there with the back marker, Mamma Mia. But it's these three who take them up there. And uh, no different in the order as they go round and out of the uh, view for a moment. It is the all orange of Downton Abbey. Downton Abbey goes one. Warhorse sneaks up into two. Into third spot goes the yellow cap of Newsworthy. Behind Newsworthy is still Blitz Creek and then Joshua. They're all strung out. And it's still Downton Abbey who takes them on. Downton Abbey. Warhorse still tucked up into second. And then there's a huge move from the back of the field all coming up now to challenge the early time leaders. But it's Downton Abbey who's going to greet the judge. And coming wide is Mama Mia, who's going to come very wide. And Manta Reef comes down the center of the track. So on the far outside, it's Downton Abbey. Warhorse in the middle of the track. And coming with a quick, quick run is Kijana. So it's now most probably Kijana and Warhorse who take it up. Here comes Leslie Sokam on Malou. And uh, Malou is going for the line now. It's horse number five, Malou, going for the line. And Malou is going to win this for John Lee. And uh, Malou is going to win this. Malou is the winner. Horse number five is the winner. Then comes a very quick horse number four and number three there. A photo finish for those. Uh, Malou is the winner. Horse number five. Well done. I guess the dog will be very happy because the dog is called Malou. So, uh, yeah, well done, John. I mean, that's a great win for the dog, but sadly it was a horse that was running, not the dog, but well ridden and steered by Leslie. Leslie, a nice race, actually. Panned out perfect for most of the riders in that race. Um, so, to me, it looked uh, a very genuine, really good run race, and you saved your energy to the end, and... Uh, came up trumps. Um, yeah, we took the hood off her this time, which um, I think made all the difference. She was always traveling well. Um, what a brave, courageous horse she is. And uh, yeah, I'd just like to say it's really nice to ride a winner for John. Um, 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 and thanks to her, him for buying the horse. And uh, what a great filly she was today to perform. Well done indeed. Uh, let me have a quick word with your mum there. And uh, yeah, John Lees has been around, uh, well, ever since I've been a tot. <laughs> Sorry, John, I'm not trying to make you look that old. But anyway, he's been around for ages, and uh, he does a good job down there when we all go to heaven. So well done, John. Um, at the moment, Malou's got no intention of going to heaven. So, Patsy, a good win there, and really good to have a winner here for John. He's been a great supporter since he's been back in racing, and I'm so chuffed because he's come almost every time except when he's had business to do. Um, but this filly is, you know, I think we've found the right distance, and... I'll have to speak to John about running her in the Oaks, but I think she probably deserves to run. I think she does indeed. And you see, he didn't bring the dog today, so the horse won. So we can always blame him, because whenever he brings the dog, the horse doesn't win. I don't know about that. We'll see on Oaks Day. <laughs> <laughs> okay, John. Well done indeed. Nice to have you here in the winner's enclosure. And uh, a lot of friends, a lot of support. 
and uh, especially on a derby day a little bit of added purse thanks to all the sponsors but well done and uh, good to see you uh, still in racing thanks very much i'm very proud today thank you for your kind words well done indeed there's john lee okay the result of this second uh, sorry of this fifth race of this afternoon the first leg of the jackpot I think the pick six, uh, we can kiss that goodbye with this winner here. The winner, horse number five, Malou. Second is number four, Mama Mia. Third is number three, um, Downton Abbey. Fourth is number six, uh, Black Pepper. And fifth, number two, Blitzkrieg. That's the result. The next race is the big one. We're going to do an official uh, welcome to the jockeys, to the sponsors, uh, parade. So... Hang around here uh, and watch the jockeys be introduced to the sport. Where, Pachua? Ah, great. Super. Right. Last time I met these lovely ladies was down at uh, Navasha. Uh, Gil uh, Elementita at the uh, show in Elementita. Here comes the uh, fashion parade. Well done, ladies. Okay. You're looking great. So, without further ado, Pachua. Welcome to Ngong. I know you support racing. I know you support polo, but that is not good. This is better. So we'd like to see you more often at Ngong race course. Thank you very much. We just had a lovely winner there, Malou, trained by Patchy Circum, owned by John Lees, and ridden there by Leslie. So without further ado, the winning owner, the winning trainer, and uh, the winning jockey all get a lovely, lovely gift there for of a bottle of Verve Clicquot. So thank you very, very much. So wonderful to have you here today. And congratulations to Malou. Woof, woof. Waiting all right, I repeat, waiting all right. 